Welcome! In this video, we'll go over what's new in FL Studio Mobile 4.2. You can now slice all clips in the playlist. Position the playhead where you want to make the cut, and then tap the clip and select More, then Slice. Finally, a way to chop audio into pieces. We have added a comb filter module. A comb filter is actually a special type of delay that can have very tight delays, so you get phase cancellation with equidistant notches in the frequency spectrum. By default, it will snap to equal temperament pitches, so it can be used as a resonator. The frequency is decided by an octave and note slider here. Tap here to unsnap. Now we have a frequency parameter in Hertz. Notice the feedback control. That is the same as it would be in a delay. A symmetry detunes the frequency parameter for the left and right channel. Smoothing will smooth out changes in the frequency parameter. That will create a pitch glide or portamento effect when it is snapped. You can select what parts of the feedback signal to invert in polarity. Left, right or both. When you select both, you'll get resonances that have odd harmonics only, so it will make things sound like a square wave. You can also have it track incoming MIDI notes from the channel. Or it can automatically detect and track pitch for monophonic signals. Break down my walls, you know you got me standing so tall with your love. We have massively overhauled audio routing in FL Studio Mobile. All channels can now send to as many FX channels as you need and the master in parallel. Yes, even FX channels themselves can do that. Simply tap Add Send here to route your audio to either an existing or a new FX channel. These are post fader. This makes it possible to do more complex routing. For example, you can now have a bus for your drum sounds and still send the snare to a reverb on its own. When you tap the send name, you're taken to its channel automatically. To go back, press the little back button up here. Trans delay has been updated to feature an input panning control that enables traditional ping pong delay. This control won't be enabled when any of the other modes is selected. And that's all we added in FL Studio Mobile 4.2. Don't forget to check out the video information for manual pages discussing the new features and the projects we made for this video. Happy music making! <laughs>